What's going on YouTube? This is your boy back at it again. Just breathe 415. Back with another video. It's been a long time, but I'm back with the Cooster 250cc, 300cc, whatever you want to call it. I don't know yet, but it runs again. So we're going to give y'all a look at what happened, what I did. If y'all don't know how this thing looked before, go back and check out my other video and see what I had to go through. So, let's get this video started. Bye. All right, here we go, folks. <clears throat> so, like I said, if y'all didn't see the breakdown of this four-wheeler and the horror I had to go through to figure out what was wrong, everything else, anything in the world. Like I said, there's a million videos on YouTube talking about the wiring, everything else. So, right now, this bike is working starts up i had a problem with it starting up but the guy that worked on the actual um wiring uh he didn't he just put the the carburetor in he didn't tune it so i had to figure out for like two or three days what was going on with that but i finally got that running so it you know it's it's an older atv so it doesn't crank up on the first try like it should because basically like i said i haven't really tuned it like it's supposed to be on the carburetor but give y'all a close look at what the wiring is so like i got all new wiring before it was all over the place um wiring everything goes the only thing that's not connected oh and i needed a new gas tank this is just temporary this is off of uh predator 212 i work on those too got the motors and stuff over there got the bikes in the shed but I work on those so for now this is the tank I'm using plus it's a bigger tank than the one I was used before I don't know if you can see that little tank over there that wasn't gonna get me down the block so I just switched over to this one so I can get a bigger tank I finally found the seat for it after 15 tries let's see where's the seat there's the seat right there so after 15 tries of getting wrong seats and well, I'm over here. Might as well show y'all the gas tank. Look at that little bitty gas tank. That wasn't going to hold nothing. So, anyway. But after a million tries of getting the seat, I finally got the seat. So that fits on there. Um, what else? Did the custom exhaust. I think that, that was already done before when I was breaking it down. But this is the old one. And I had to get a pipe welded right here for that to fit. And then oh, it fits on right here. So full exhaust now, full exhaust. I still need a back brake. So if anybody knows the number to this size Cooster, let me know, please. Oh, got the front brakes working just enough to stop. It's still probably just have to get some new ones, but oh, and I'm gonna do, I still need the front front nose they're always out of those so i'm waiting on the front nose i change the light they still have lights on them right there uh, but i'm not gonna hook those up just gonna run with the big light kind of give that banji style uh light that came off a of coleman uh 200 mini bike so and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna i'm gonna splice into this and then put um use a, a car fog light uh hook up and then just run it from there to the battery so it'll be brighter um what else i've done i still need the the foot rest but i'm gonna have to buy that whole thing because of the ones i found it's only half so i don't know if that'll fit but this thing wraps all the way around to the other side so it's a whole bottom piece right there But yeah, let me show y'all this thing starts up. I know y'all getting bored of me talking. 
Well, let me show. Oh, yeah, and I also put <clears throat> instead of the starter being right there, you know, I had them custom make me a button right here. So, but it, it can, like I said, I only had the problem with it not starting first when I first got it back because he never tuned the carb. So now that I kind of got the carb semi tuned, it turns on and it stays on. I rode it around the block, everything else like that. So riding footage is coming later, but let me show y'all how this thing works and how it sounds. Okay, so y'all know I'm only a one man band here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put y'all down and then we gonna, uh, I gotta show y'all how it started. Or should I say how it sounds? Uh -oh. Hold on. It never needed a key before, so I always forget that. A few moments later. Yeah, I didn't want to run it too long because um, the exhaust, I still have to get exhaust wrapped. So as you see right here, it's gonna, it's gonna start burning. So I gotta get that going. But as you see, it's, it's, it's running now. Um, before it wouldn't even do it that. So, or kick over, should I say. Um, so yeah, y'all stay tuned for more on this Cooster. Um, like I said, I'm still looking for the front nose. Um, I might paint the frame, um, might do the wheels, uh, paint the wheels, um, whatever else I can come up with. But y'all stay tuned and I'll have more videos on this for those that need help. Um, Drop a like, drop drop a like, <laughs> drop a like, a comment, leave a comment. I answer right back. That's to all my videos. I leave comments right back as soon as you hit me up. And on that note, I'm out of here. It's starting to get hot. So I'll check y'all out. Peace.